Hello and welcome back to another episode of The Binding of Isaac. My name is Classic Tim, and today we're playing some... Who are we playing? I don't remember his name. It is Lazarus. There we go. I remember. Um, so we start with three hearts and one extra life on a random pill by the looks of it. And we got luck down. That's a lucky start. Alright, so let's just get going, I guess. This is an interesting room. It's definitely big enough for us to, uh, to dodge, though, so that's not, not a problem. Even though there are a lot of enemies in it. So hopefully we get some stuff to increase damage uh, pretty quick here. Cause, cause, well, actually, my damage seems to be okay at the moment. What are we sitting at? We're two, two bars, the usual. Um, whoa, I didn't see that coming. Well, thank you for that, at least. Man, that did a whole heart of damage. I don't know if this games are getting harder or what, but I've had a couple runs here where I haven't gotten even past the first couple floors. I don't bother uploading those, they wouldn't be very entertaining to watch. Um, so let's move through here. Alright, we got the Book of Revelations. I got that um, recently. So what this does is it gives you a soul heart when you use it, and it also makes the next boss you fight uh, on the next floor a uh, four horseman boss. So I'll go ahead and use it. Um, I'm not sure how I'll do against the four horsemen, so we'll have to uh, see on that one. Um, usually a couple of them are, ju are just fine, but I did fight um, on one of them, and he was really tough. I actually died on him, so hopefully we don't get him. Alright, so far so good. No problems. Alright, we'll take that. I get full health, not bad. Uh, we got a cursed room here. I think I'm gonna go in it. We have the soul heart. Alright, just some spiders in the first chest. That's too bad. Um, soul heart. Two soul hearts. Amazing. And we unfortunately cannot open this because we don't have a bomb or anything, so we'll just have to annoy that. But we did come out with a soul heart um, added that cursed room, so it's definitely worth it. Some more of these guys. These guys are pretty nice. You know, not too not too annoying to dodge. Well, I'm kind of getting cornered here. There we go. All right, we got a bomb. Nice. Not going to be worth going into the soul, uh, the cursed room. I mean, again, because we would just uh, take more damage for whatever is in that chest. I don't think it's worth it. But we'll go for the secret room, and that's disappointing. I cannot use it. I don't have any keys. I mean, I don't have any coins. Alright, so that's it for this floor. Whew, that was close. Okay. Alright, we got Famine. That is thanks to our Book of Revelations. Famine is a pretty easy, though. One of the, one of the easier of the, the four horsemen, so... I think we'll do okay here. Just need to make sure to take out the flies before they become an issue. Taking them out nice and quick. Oh, I expected him to spawn in some flies. Did he do a whole heart of damage there? I think he did in one of the four horsemen. Are so annoying. You know, the Book of Revelations isn't that good if you have to fight these guys every floor. And if he's going to do a full heart of damage. Alright, so now he's doing this. are pretty easy to dodge, just gotta run around him. Thankfully he's not spawning any more flies either. And there we go. Cube of meat. Alright, that's one of the defensive familiars there. We got two extra hearts that we cannot use. Uh, but that's about it we could do for this floor. We got no bombs, no keys, and no coins, so... Moving on. Alright, so I'm gonna go in the cursed room right away. 
see if we can get anything good. And we got, he accepts your offering, goat head. I don't know what that does, let me look that up. Goat head. I assume that Binding of Isaac is going to be the, one of the first ones that comes up. A Devil Room Angel Room door will always spawn after every boss fight, excluding the first floor and floors after um, later. But uh, anyway, so that's cool. So we get a Devil Deal Room every time, which is nice. Um, it did cost us a soul heart to do, but I don't know what I expected there. Go oh, and we got a key, which is good so we can win the item room this time. Oh, I didn't know there was guys on the other side. I did not see that coming. Oh man, this, this is bad. This is bad. That's where I would have used some invincibility, that's for sure, if I had any. Yeah, I was, I was just totally like, oh, it's an easy room, and then all of a sudden a whole other wave of enemies came at me. Alright, any drop? I could really use some health now. Alright, another interesting floor, but thankfully those guys are trapped by the looks of it, so I can take out these guys nice and happily. Alright, there we go, and we can take these guys out one at a time, because I assume he's just going to start coming at us. Take him out without a problem. Came out without a problem. They came out without a problem. Yeah, these guys are nice and easy. They don't know what's up. There we go. We'll take that coin and we'll head into the item room. Alright, that is Lemon Party. Yeah, it's just a little one. I think we'll keep with this. We could use the health more. However, the, um, the four horsemen might cause us problems later. Alright, there we go. And we got a nickel there, that, that'll come in handy. Um, no keys to go in the shop. Alright, let's take those guys out no problem. Be very careful getting this chest. Two keys, we'll take it. Alright, uh, we don't have a lot of health right now, unfortunately. Um, or bombs to go into the um, secret room, but we do have some coins, so I missed a heart over here. So we possibly go in here. Yeah, this is what I was hoping for. I was hoping we could buy um, a bomb here. So we have a bomb or a soul heart. I think I'm gonna go for the soul heart because we could get a a not so good. Um, secret room, but the soul heart's a guaranteed heart, so I'll take that. And I'll head to the boss. Alright, we got Monstro. Alright, good. It's not a four horseman boss. I can take out Monstro. Pretty easy fight. Could really use some damage increase though. This is another run where I've just not gotten a lot of damage increasing. I haven't increased my damage at all actually since the... Um, or at all period. So I'm kind of running around here on the second floor with out much damage. Alright, well there he goes. We did that without taking damage. That's good. And we got the Devil Deer Room as promised. The heart. And we'll take this. We got HP up, so that means we can spend some money in the Devil Deer Room. Two black hearts. An amazing start. And we'll go ahead and take this. Fear shot. So it can possibly be, um, give enemies fear. I think that was worth it. Um, I'd be scared too, looking at my eyes. 
Unfortunately, though, can't take that heart, but we can head out of here. And we have a key. No bombs. Yep, I think we're, uh... Did I go into the... Oh, that's the arena. I think I'm good to just go on. Okay. All these guys know. Alright, he's got fear. He's got fear. That's good. And I got hit anyway. Every time with these guys. I think I'm gonna go in here. Uh, that was not worth it. But I had quite a bit of health at the moment, so I feel like I could. I was, I was, I should, I was okay to do that. Um, I cannot hit these guys for the life of me. I believe that the fear shot has lowered my range a little bit. One coin for an entire black heart. Wouldn't call that worth it. Well, I suppose it's better than no coins. Guys are a bit more annoying to dodge than just the straight on ones. Alright, we got a key. That's good. Still no bombs. Oh man. The one place I did not think that they would go. Taking more damage than I'd like. But that's nothing new. I don't know what I ever like to take damage. Uh, we've got a heart there. Can't use it right now. We can go into the item room. Shielded Tears. That could have turned this run around. We could still use some more damage, but this is definitely going to help our defense. So that's good. We have one more room until we can get another soul heart, which is going to be this one. Unfortunately, these guys do not work with the Shield of Tears, but they do work with the Fear Shots. So if I hit them while they're charging at me and it happens to fear them, that just saved me right there, that's for sure. Man, my range is really small, though, that's for sure. I could definitely use some range increase. Um, where's the last guy? There you are. Nothing dropped with the arena down there. We can get the soul heart. Ooh, lots of movement there. Man, I just, yeah, I cannot reach these guys at my current uh, setup. Alright, good. They stopped shooting when um, they're, they're afraid of me. It's good. Use that to my advantage. All right, we got a heart there. Cannot use it, so let's move this way and in here. Nothing. No secret rocks. Doesn't matter if I did. I don't have any bombs. All right, I forgot I had shield tears. I can kind of just hang out then. There we go. Take the key. These guys are much easier with shielded tears. Come on, shoot away. Uh, half a heart, can't use it. Um, I have two keys, so I'll go in the shop. May as well. Um, we could buy a bomb, or whatever this thing is. I think I'm just gonna get the bomb. We need one, can't afford that, so. Take that coin, and we'll donate the rest. I bombed a little bit out earlier, so I wanna replace that. Oh, yeah, my damage must be a little bit higher now. Okay, so we've got the boss here, and all this stuff is the arena, so... Um, well, the, the secret room could possibly be here. It's not definite, though. I think I'm gonna try. Alright, good. I didn't waste my bomb. And we got a black heart. Alright, so we basically bought a black heart for five points, so that's, that's a pretty good deal. Alright, we got Pestilence. This is the guy that I really had some trouble with earlier, but I think he's going to be easier with our, with our shielded tears plus our fear shots. Um, dang it. Yeah, it's the, um, it was the, uh, little worms here that really caused me trouble, so. 
Um, with the fear shots, that should make this easier. Um, of course, the, the actual bombing isn't much better either. Alright, there he goes. Actually, he gets feared too, so that's pretty good. Um, but the range is so small that uh, we really have to get close to him, unfortunately. I don't think that uh, I'm getting cornered here. Yeah, the, the shielded tears do nothing against that um, that bomb shot. I could really use some range increase here. Alright, his head is gone, so hopefully he'll stop spawning in these worms. Um, he's spawning in flies now, which I can definitely take care of. Oh, come on, my range is ridiculous right now. Alright, just watch out for the creep on the floor. Come on. Get feared. There we go. And we got second cube of meat. Oh, he's got a face now. That's nice. Alright, and we got the promised Devil Deal room. Okay, so we have Guppy's Paw, which is a soul converter, so we can convert actually, um, soul hearts, um, red hearts to soul hearts, but I was just going to say I did not want that, because this gives us soul hearts anyway. Um, and then these two aren't that great, so that was a waste of a heart. Awesome. I did not want to do that. Alright, well, I guess we're moving on. Note to self, pay a little bit more attention when looking at Devil Deal items. Something you probably learn rather early. Because I'm not really into using up my red hearts here. Oh, he's not going to try and shoot us now, is he? Oh, he is. Cool. Um... Yeah, we got a soul heart here. Let's just go in here. We might get something good. Or nothing good at all. Maybe I'll get lucky and I'll drop a soul heart after we finish. And another coin. Alright, soul heart for a coin. Yeah, there we go. Those fear shots are pretty nice. Yeah, what we could really just do with is a, is a range increase. So I don't think my range has ever been this low. I mean, like, I think Azazel's got more range than we do. We're getting lots of hard drops, but we can't use them. We just have to be shooting in the direction that we're getting shot at from, and we should be safe. makes that a whole lot easier. Oh, we got some money. That's good. Another heart that we cannot use. We're getting a lot of hearts. We have a heart in almost every single room on this floor. Oh, I didn't realize that our um, little cube of meat, which is now no longer a cube, is actually shooting with us. I didn't realize that. Alright, so we can use a bomb to get a key and a chest, but we don't have a bomb, so... That's a moot point. We're almost at another soul heart, at least. Oh, troll bomb. I wish that the uh, fear did anything to these guys. Losing so much health on these guys more than I should. We do have a soul heart though, so I can use that. Doesn't help that my range is so low, so I have to be close to them anyway. Um, my range is actually. Now let me just. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Pretty bad. Range up. 
Monstro's Tooth summons Monstro. Who hurts me. Wouldn't call it the best thing ever. I was hoping for a range up. Did he actually do damage though? It's hard to tell. Oh, man, even when I have shielded tears, these guys still manage to get me. These guys are the bane of my existence. Quite literally. Um, yeah, we'll go this way for right now. These guys pretty much already have fear. Dang it. Not doing too well on the health point. Wealth of answers. I don't know what that does. some health with that chest. I'm not sure where that key came from, because it didn't come from the original uh, floor there. Um, we can go in a shop. Greed. Yep, I could get greed pretty commonly. helpful. At least we got our key back. And a second key. Who's giving us the key? I wonder if it's the, the little penny thing. The little flat penny that we got. And I'll take the free keys. Um... Tears working on these guys? Because their tears are kind of like hopping up, you see? And of course they did actually do damage to me. Um, thankfully we'll have a lot of health on this floor. I'm actually gonna pick that up now just in case. Because we're sitting at one heart. There we go. Back up to three at least. And we don't have a lot of health. Oh, that, that guy totally went around me. Um, but... We do have shielded tears, so we shouldn't take too much damage. Hopefully. In essence. That's the idea. Alright, we got a boss here. And another key. Um, let's see. We could possibly have a secret room right here. Well then, we could have a normal secret room right here. Nope. A couple more bombs. Um, maybe right here? No. Huh. I wonder where they are then. I guess I haven't tried right here. We can go in and get that chest either way. Oh man, lots of keys. Yeah, I guess we're getting a, a key every time we pick up a coin. Or almost every time, at least. Yeah, it's surprising that we, um... That there were no... I guess I didn't try this one. Alright, there we go. That is the normal secret room. That's an interesting perk. We have not really have to worry about keys much anymore, especially considering that we've been getting a lot of coins. We're sitting at 36 coins at the moment. Uh, what else was in the shop? I feel like I should at least check now that I have a ton of coins. I have to run all the way around. Oh yeah, I forgot. It was greed. So next floor we'll get 
lots of um, stuff from the shop, hopefully. Almost did it. All right, Gertie, a nice, easy fight. How did he hit me? I got shielded tears. All right, that fly is becoming an issue. There we go. All right, now we can kind of just hang out. Oh man, so much for hanging out. All right. I think we hang out more on the side here so we can hit that fly too. Uh, I guess shielded tears aren't as overpowered as I remember. We're well, not doing a lot of damage though, that's for sure. Take him out. There we go. And we still have our Devil Dealer Room. With two hearts, though, they have to be a pretty good item. So that is Guppy's Collar. Which... Well, we're fast now. Um, I think that gives you nine lives. Could possibly do it. I don't have a lot of health either way. I think I'm going to go for it. Oh, so it just gave me the option. All right, so now we're in a risky situation, but let's go. All right, so we got one help. We do have shielded tears, though. So I feel like we could make it a little bit further. You know, I mean, we could really use some HP ups, uh, up upgrades, that's for sure. I mean, technic technically, we have a little more health, since we have, like, two lives. At least one more life. Um, but I could really use some health at the moment. We could use as much health as we can. Run! Problem is, a lot of my tears are being deflected by theirs. Ooh, that was close. That was that was risky business. All right, sweet, a heart. Just have to get to it. All right, we made it through that. Um, yeah, I guess I have to grab the heart. I mean, not like I could save it. Yeah, let's move on. Not gonna be able to go in there. Oh, this is not happy. I'm sitting on such low health. Very careful, there we go, okay. Made it through. Some brains. My skulls are getting in the way. All right, one more left. We can take it. I think that these um, these runs where you get really low health are really actually kind of fun. All right, we did get a soul heart, so that's good. You know, a run where you're just running around with full health the whole time isn't isn't as nearly as interesting. As I tell myself, um, as I die, very shortly. Just trying to deflect the tears. Eh. Oh yeah, I forgot I had the soul heart. That's good because <laughs> I took two. I took a whole heart of damage there. Um, that was disappointing. All right, so we're back at half a heart now. No! I just cannot hit this guy. Stop hopping. Oh, there we go. Okay, full health though. Luck up. All right, I'll take it. All right. Oh man. Oh, well, that's the cursed room over there anyway, which I don't think we're going to be going in. Right, we got a Larry Jr. kind of thing. A couple of them. Well, that was to be expected. Okay, but we did get the, the extra life there. Um, and we actually didn't even respawn. I thought we respawned. That was probably because that was the... Um, 
because we were whatever his name is. I, I forgot again. Um, but that was not the Guppy's Collar effect. But we still have the Guppy's Collar effect. But that's only a chance of an extra life. So we could actually just die and lose it. Um, and this might be it. Alright, that was good. Those guys are really pretty annoying to dodge. I hear a lot of health. Oh, we have a heart here, just in case. I'm sure at some point I'll need. Yeah, the shielded tiers give an appearance of having very high damage um, because it makes the tiers so big. But really, you don't. I'm sitting at four damage, which actually isn't that bad, but not good either. I kind of wish those guys were not running away because this means I'm going to have to deal with them later instead of dealing with them right away. Eh, eh, get him. I can barely outshoot them. So it's just to be careful to take them only on one at a time, that's for sure. Alright, come on. Taking them out slowly and but surely. Alright. We gotta be very careful with our health here. Come down here. I don't want to have to come to you. I keep running away. Okay, there we go. We got one. Alright, there we go. Got a half heart in here. That's good. We're still pretty far away from... That ghost almost got me. Oh, that was close. He almost came towards us. <laughs> he was running away and still dodging my attacks. Right, we really got fast all of a sudden. Oh, man, this is annoying because as soon as those guys get off the fear, they're going to come right back at me again. Actually, all have fear now, so that's, that's helpful. And the problem is, it's if they're split up where half of the room is running away and half of the room is running towards you, then you lose the, the ability to dodge them. But that was okay. We got a key. And we're doing pretty good so far. We've only only died the once. Um, let's just go on there really quick. I don't want to have to deal with those uh, Dead Sea Scrolls. I don't know what that did. But I'm just going to keep it, stick around with this. Um, I feel like they shoot at me. They shoot at me. Okay, we survived though. That's good. <laughs> we have a half heart though, so I'm going to run out of here real quick. Yeah, stay away from the purple tears. Uh, purple fire. Um, we did get a soul heart though, so that's good. And we actually still have the guppies... Um, collar effect, so we still have actually a chance to respawn again. Which is good, because I feel like we're going to need it. What did I take damage from? Oh man, I didn't realize that there was a jumper left. Ah, dang it. Alright, we're back to half a heart. Um, but we do have a shot down here. Hopefully they sell a soul heart. Nope, they sell this, so that's almost as good. And I'm going to go ahead and buy the bomb, because I have the coins. And I'm going to buy the compass, too. Oh. I thought the compass showed where the secret rooms are. I guess it just shows me where the boss room is. Which could actually come in handy later. Get out of there, quick! Quick! Alright, we have a half a heart up here, so we're sitting at two hearts now. Um, possibly search around for the secret room a little bit. I haven't been checking at all for uh, secret rocks. I really should be. Especially considering my health situation. Um, not seeing much. Check here for the secret room. Nope. Only have two bombs left. Could pop. 
possibly be here? Nope. Alright, I'm kind of wasting my bombs here. Not sure where else it could possibly be. Those are definitely the obvious choices. Get out there, quick, quick! Alright, and we'll try here for the super secret room. Alright, at least we got that. And it's that hand thing. Monkey paw. Um, I think that turns normal chests into red chests, which I'm not interested in. Alright, we've got war. Hopefully I can do okay here. He's got fear on him, so that's good. Um, he's not supposed to be dodging me, though. If he just does attacks like that, I can definitely manage. Focus on dodging. Hopefully, he doesn't spawn in too much um, annoying stuff. Get off the rocks. That I can totally dodge. I just have to make sure to watch out for those attacks. Alright, um, I don't like this mode because he's very fast, but we are very fast too, so we're faster than usual. Alright, and he's got fear on him. Okay, so I think we can do this. Let's if we do this. We're, we've got a good setup to fight against this guy. Between the fear and the, um... Oh, we got another cube of meat! Oh, he's walking around now. We got our own little buddy. Alright, so we did get a soul heart from that, which is good. And in here we got three chests, two soul hearts, amazing. Uh, blue spiders, awesome. And two troll bombs. Alright, so that's not the worst thing we could have gotten in here. Alright, and we're sitting at four soul hearts, um, no bombs. And I think we're just good to go. Um, I think we can go in the arcade. Hopefully get some soul hearts out of here. Got another blue spider. And a bomb and a key. Um, don't want to use that. No, I'm not going to waste my money on that guy. Oh, dang it. He was just at the right angle to where I couldn't block his attacks. Our range has definitely increased a lot, thankfully. Oh, these are the ones that move. Oh, dang it. Dang it. That was a pain. Uh, I'm getting cornered here. That's interesting. I can actually give them the fear effect if I don't hit them in the brain. Good to know. Because then I can cause them to run away and then hit them. Um, so this is annoying. Yeah, spikes. Not so nice. Um, I should probably get out of the spikes. But there's a lot of poop over there. So I don't know if I want to. I'm gonna try moving out because he moved into those spikes. No! Alright, so that was a disappointing room. Took a lot of damage in there. Yeah, we got a ton of keys. Just focus. Oh man, that cube of meat's a, a boss. Um, something's giving me this blood effect when I get hit. Alright, so I'm down three hearts already on this floor, so I need to really pick it up. Um, it does it is telling me where the boss is. Oh, this is not good, this is not good.
Dang it. More spike damage. Ow! Oh, there's three of those guys. That's not good. Alright, they're already dead though, so that's cool. I think that the, uh, the spikes caused that. Alright, back up to two hearts. Yeah, you guys should definitely stop doing that. Yeah, you guys should really stop doing that. Alright, um... I think I'm just gonna go to the boss right now. Not sure what else I could get in this room, so... Oh, this is Mom! I didn't even think about it. Alright, well, let's see if we can get through the Mom fight with two hearts. Um, it'd be a task, that's for sure. But I feel like I could do it. I feel like I'm, I'm getting better at this to where I could definitely do it. Or maybe not. Maybe not. Being nice to me not stomping down with, with her foot too much. So just know the next time she does that, I'm dead. Oh man, how did that guy hit me? I wonder why she hasn't stomped down her foot in a while. Oh darn. Did I live? No, I did not. Oh, well, that's too bad. That was an interesting run. Um, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed the, the risk of being at such low health for so long. But I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. I'm going to leave a like if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time.